Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. It is currently Sunday morning for me. It is 8.30 a.m. I'm going into work at 9.30 today and I thought why not do a little bit of a work day in my life vlog. I've never done one like this. Um, in June I got my first ever job outside of the house and I have been loving it ever since. Um, it is almost September now so it's been three months and I have really been enjoying it. So I thought it'd be a fun idea to do a little work day in my life vlog. I don't know how much I'm gonna actually be able to vlog when I'm at work but when I go on break I will and then I thought I could do like a little bit of a pre-work routine as well. So you've seen already what happened what I got up to this morning. I got up at around 6 30 uh because I had some extra work to do. I had to send out our weekly recipes to our online coaching clients and then just my regular like social media work as well and then I had breakfast which was some cereal and like protein milk and then some berries and banana. I also took my supplements and had my collagen boosting powder as well. That's a pretty typical morning for me so far. Next up, I'm gonna do a quick workout. On days when I'm working, my workout is usually 30 to 45 minutes, but I still make sure to get it in there. And usually I do like a mixture of full body because I don't work every day. It's more of like a, like a boot camp kind of thing or like hit a little bit shorter and faster. Now I'm just getting ready for that. I put my contacts in, I'm gonna brush my teeth. I'm also gonna do my hair and then get dressed and then I'm gonna get into my workout. My shift today is 9.30 to 5.30. So whenever I have a full day like that, um, I usually get a 30 minute break. Um, and usually it's around lunchtime so I can have a quick little lunch. And then on my break, I'll show you what I like to do. Um, but usually I like to walk around and do more social media work while I'm on my break. So I have my lunch and then I do my social media work. And while I do that, I like to walk around and get my steps instead of just like sitting, you know? So I finished my workout and I'm all ready for work now. So I'm wearing a Lululemon t-shirt and then I have these pants on. They're cute and flowy and stripy and I think they're from Abercrombie and Fitch but I actually got them at Play-Doh's Closet. And then I just have these little shoes on that Daisy got for me from Winners. And that's the outfit. <laughs> all right hi everybody update time i am currently on my break it is i believe just about 1 p.m i have 20 minutes left of my break i get a 30 minute break uh at some point throughout the day and on that break i had my lunch which was the protein overnight oats that i made this morning so they weren't really overnight but it was like protein morning oats i guess um they are perfect exactly what i needed while I worked this morning, I made a decaf Americano and I drank that. Um, I might do that again. And now since I have 20 more minutes left on my break, I just like to walk around and get some steps. And this is the time usually when I will respond to Instagram comments and do like my social media work and stuff like that. 
Um, so I'm just gonna get up to that. I'm so glad that the sun is out for my break because it's kind of been cloudy this, today. So it's nice that the sun came out for me. I've talked a little bit about my job, but I haven't said too much. And that's just because I've kind of wanted to keep that part of my life like private. And then also I'm not really supposed to talk about it too much anyway. Like the company doesn't want me to, um, but I'll say a few things. I work at a local Vancouver based company and I work as a barista. I'm learning to make all the barista drinks anyway. Um, right now I'm learning how to make a traditional cappuccino. I know how to make Americanos. I mean, working on lattes. So it's something so new to me and it's so much fun and I enjoy it so much. So it's 5.15 p.m. now. I just finished my shift and I'm just waiting for my parents to pick me up from work. Again, I'm so glad the sun is out still. Okay, hi everyone. So it's been a bit since I've updated you. So I'm now home. It is 6.45 and when I got home, I had my snacks, so I had some baby carrots and some like protein chips. And then I had a shower and I actually did a whole video. I made up a video, created a video, edited a video for Instagram, all about my current skincare routine and favorites. So I'm gonna put that up here if you wanna watch it and see what my favorite skincare products are. So that's something that I usually do when I get home from work is I have a second post to prepare and plan and post when I get home. So that's what I did today. Um, now I'm gonna get started on making some dinner for the family. And me too, I'm gonna eat dinner too. So a bit of an update, it is now 9.08 and I just realized that I forgot that I put my bed sheets in the wash when I got home and they're still wet. So I put them in the dryer and hopefully they'll dry in time so that I can put them on my bed. But what I'm planning on doing now while I wait for that is I have some laundry to fold, some laundry to put away, and then I'm going to do some reading and then just like my nighttime like beauty routine. And hopefully by that time, my sheets are dry and I can put them on my bed. Laundry is all put away now and I'm going to get into the rest of my nighttime routine. Starting off, I'm going to use this Frey Cleanse Me Miss Alert Cleanser. Usually I would do my full nighttime routine, like skincare routine. Um, but because I did that earlier for my Instagram video, I'm just going to go in with my cleanser for now. Next, I'm going to take my contacts out and it's super exciting because just yesterday I opened a new set of contacts to use. I use bi-weekly contacts, which means that they're good for two weeks. And when I opened it yesterday, I had the realization that this would be the last pair of contacts I'll ever have to be wearing again. Um, because in under two weeks, I'm getting my PRK surgery, which is so exciting. Um, so this is the last pair of contacts I'll be wearing for the rest of my life. Okay, now this is something new that I've been using. Um, the eye doctor recommended it for me. So these are the Eyelid and Lash Daily Cleansing Gel for lid and lashes. It's like an eye cleanser and makeup remover. So I use this to take off my mascara, but also I recently learned that like my eyes can get really oily or something like that. And then it leaves like residue on my eyelashes. And that's something that I just have to make sure that I'm cleaning. So that's something I've started doing. I just use one of these little like cleansing wipes. I just wipe my eye and I'll do the other one as well just like that the toothpaste I'm currently using is the crush and brush toothpaste tablets um, but this is actually the mint flavor not the root beer like it says on the little glass jar I refilled them at like the little refillery bulk food store and I got mint um, these are really good I've been enjoying them so I just do one tab and then crush it up and then brush my teeth as you usually would Every single night, I also make sure to floss. So I actually have this little stainless steel floss container with biodegradable vegan corn fiber floss in it. I got these actually at the Vegan Expo in the beginning of June. They're kind of floss refills. There's two of them in there. There's little rolls like that. 
kind of just a little bit better for the environment, you know? So I try to do what I can. Next thing I don't do every single night, but when I have a little bit of extra time, I usually like to do this. This is something new I got actually when we were in Whistler uh, from a farmer's market actually. So this is the Playlist Orchard Glowing Hair Oil. And I just like to put this at the top, kind of like at my roots to help with my hair growth. And then I also like to put it at the ends for split ends. And I also like to put it underneath like my neck hairs where it's a little bit shorter from me always having my hair up in a bun or having it in braids, just to help those little back pieces grow a little bit more. So I just do a little bit, just like to like press it into this. And then anything I have left over on my hands, I'll just go at the top of my head like this. And then after that, I'll actually just brush my hair like normal. Now that I finished that, my sheets are dry and it's time to put them on my bed. I'm in my freshly made bed, which is like one of the best feelings in the world. And I'm going to do a little bit of reading before I head to bed. I hope you enjoyed this little bit of a day in my life, work day in my life vlog. I hope you found it interesting. If you did, please like and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And if you'd like to see more, let me know because I can definitely do more of these types of workday vlogs, especially for different shifts. Maybe that'd be more interesting. I would love to know um, if you have a job, what do you do? How often do you work? Tell me all the things. Comment down below. Again, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye!